Oh, Jesus! You all snuck up on me. Good Lord, children. Can't sneak up on old Sawtooth with the bird shit. The bird shit's jumpy. There's not a lot of people in the tunnels down here underneath Pittsburgh. It's just me and the boys. Very rarely do I get any visitors in these parts. Just me living and working, sharpening my cow horn underneath the city of Pittsburgh. <sighs> it's a real nice place to live. I'm glad you came down to visit and I can show you around a little bit. Show you around a little bit. See what we got back here, we got the shelves, right? And then uh, over here we got the place where I keep my hatchet. It's, it's my hatchet. It don't have a name. Because why would you name a hatchet? Never name a hatchet. That's what my grandma used to say. And down here is uh, the entrance to the rest of the tunnels in Pittsburgh. I just come here from time to time to talk to my hatchet and sharpen up my cow horn. This cow horn was a gift. Ugh. I've had this cow horn for uh, good on 20, 30, 50 years or so. This was a gift from the former mayor of Pittsburgh, Sophie Mayer's love. Oh, never seen a beauty like Sophie Mayer's love. She was good to me. Mm -mm -mm. She was good to me. She'd come down to the tunnels every now and then uh, bearing gifts for the hobo. I'm 50% hobo. Uh, I didn't used to be a hobo, but that's, that's a story for another day. So from Asloff came down, and uh, I would do a hair. You see, I used to be a hairdresser. They used to call me the boxcar beautician. And she would bring a six-pack or a seven-pack, as they used to be, of Iron City, and she'd spread the love around. And I would do her hair, and she would tell stories about when Sophie used to be a hobo. Oh, yes. Yes, children. Sophie used to be a hobo. Uh, that is a little known fact about Sophie Maslow. That's why she's so wise to the people because she lived and moved amongst them. Now, she said it was from a cow, but I don't believe her. Uh, she had a reputation for not lying, but those are the people, those are the people that usually lie the most to you. If they say, oh, nobody, she's an honest, honest as, as no, what the hell? What in the, get back, get back, you pigeon, get, I didn't ask you to come out here. I am talking to the children right now, and the pigeons are not welcome out here. See, what happens is, there's a little known fact about the tunnels underneath pigeons. Uh, Ha <laughs> <laughs>